Hey everyone, in today's video, I wanna show you how to add a custom thumbnail to Facebook videos. Now you have to upload on a Facebook business page. So I'm on a Facebook business page here. This doesn't currently work for a personal video upload. So jump into a Facebook business page if you have one. If you don't have one, they're super easy to create. I have a different video about that if you're curious on how to make one. And we're gonna go ahead and add a photo and video here just by pressing this and I'm gonna say upload a photo or a video. I'm gonna do a Instagram video that I just posted on YouTube and I'm gonna show you how to add a custom thumbnail. At the end of the video, I'm gonna show you a better way also to add just new videos on here on Facebook. So just stay till the end to see that option. So let's go ahead and add your title, your description, your tags here. And now, in order to add a custom thumbnail after we added all these options, we have to come over here. So this was video detail, but if you click this tab, thumbnails, you're gonna get a bunch of different options. So you have auto-generated images here. These are just being pulled from the video, but the custom image is this option. So we could go ahead and press add or choose literally any video frame from the actual video. So we could do this and basically choose any single frame. That's very useful, a lot better than YouTube actually. But custom image is what we want. So I'm gonna choose mine. And here is the custom image that I want to add. Now I created this completely from scratch in Photoshop and I have a full video and a link to Photoshop on a free trial. So you could try Photoshop for free, watch that video and make custom thumbnails just like this for your Facebook videos. I'm gonna go ahead and open it. And because they're the same size, they're this widescreen 16 by nine, I could use them both for YouTube and for Facebook, so I don't have to create a new one here. And some other options here are subtitles, polls, tracking, and so on. But in this case, I'm gonna press next. I don't need to worry about those. And before I publish, I'm gonna view my checklist here. Everything fits. And then I could say publish now. Okay, while the video is processing, let me show you this other option that I mentioned in the beginning of the video. Typically, instead of coming to the business page and pressing photo and video and uploading it here, what I do is I go to publishing tools right up here and it takes me to this page where I could go to Creator Studio right here on the side. And Facebook Creator Studio and Instagram Creator Studio are two ways that I manage all my Instagram and Facebook accounts. So if you haven't seen this yet, definitely check this out. But on here, you could simply press upload video here and post single multiple videos. And if you do single video, it's gonna give you the same kind of layout that I just showed you, but you could do multiple videos, you could go live, you could post videos across pages and you could see your exact insights right here, not only for Facebook, but also for Instagram and for multiple different pages right here all at the same time. You could see monetization, so much is here. And I have made videos explaining Facebook Creator Studio and Instagram Creator Studio, but definitely check this out and upload your videos via this page right here in the future. And make sure they all have the custom thumbnail that I just showed you how to upload. I hope you found this useful. Make sure you check out the description for all the links to everything I talked about. And I hope to catch you on the next video. Thanks so much for watching.